Hello. Welcome to our daily devotions for the noon hour from the Book of Common Prayer, page 138. Readings from Romans, chapter 3, verses 1 through 8. Give praise, you servants of the Lord. Praise the name of the Lord. Let the name of the Lord be blessed from this time forth forevermore. From the rising of the sun to its going down, let the name of the Lord be praised. The Lord is high above all nations and his glory above the heavens. Then, what advantage has the Jew? Or what is the value of circumcision? Much in every way. For in the first place, the Jews were entrusted with the oracles of God. What if some were unfaithful? Will their faithlessness nullify the faithfulness of God? By no means. Although everyone is a liar, let God be proved true, as it is written, so that you may be justified in your words and prevail in your judging. But if our injustice serves to confirm the justice of God, what should we say? That God is unjust to inflict wrath on us? I speak in a human way. By no means. But then how could God judge the world? But if through my falsehood God's truthfulness abounds to his glory, why am I still being condemned as a sinner? And why not say, as some people slander us by saying that we say, let us do evil so that good may come? Their condemnation is deserved. Grant, O Lord, that we may see true proportions of all claims on me and may deal justly with my time, my affections, the power of my money, and the power of my tongue. Give me the true sense of justice which springs from the inside of a loving heart. Grant that neither indolence nor prejudice, self-seeking nor favoritism, may make me unjust to others, and that no party spirit, no party spirit nor ignorant zeal for you, may blind me to the truth as revealed in Jesus Christ, our Savior. Amen. Our Lord's Prayer from page 97 in our Book of Common Prayer, the Contemporary Version. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I give to you, my own peace I leave with you. Regard not our sins, but the faith of your church, and give to us the peace and unity of that heavenly city, where with the Father and the Holy Spirit you live and reign, now and forever. Amen.